it's tough being a boss. You got more responsibility. My name is Paul Pasolka, Ivy Masters Learning Center at ivymasters.com. And today we're going to look at Test 7, Section 3, Number 9, which reads, Marissa needs to hire at least 10 staff members for an upcoming project. Staff members will be made up of junior directors who will be paid $640 per week and senior directors who will be paid $880 per week. Her budget for paying the staff members is no more than $9,700 per week. She must hire at least three junior directors, at least one senior director. Which of the following systems of inequalities represents the conditions described? If X is the number of junior directors, Y is the number of senior directors. It sounds like a lot, but this is a pretty common type of question. It's a long inequality word problem, and you've got several inequalities in the answer choices. Look for the low-hanging fruit, the stuff that's easy to understand, at least 10 staff members. So it looks like X and Y are your junior and senior directors, and we don't even have to say who's junior and who's senior just yet. If it's at least 10 staff members, then X plus Y's gotta be greater than or equal to 10. And what you could do if you're not sure um, greater than, less than, you could pick numbers. So if I had like six of each, then that would be okay. That would be 12. And answer choice A is saying X plus Y is less than 10. So that's gone. B is good. It's greater than or equal to. Uh, C is good. Greater than or equal to 10. D is gone. X plus Y is less than or equal to 10. And then junior deck directors will be paid at least $640 per week. Senior directors will be paid $800 in $80 per week. So all of them have 640 attached to the X. So the X must be junior and the Y must be senior. And then it says her budget for paying staff members is no more than. If it's no more than, then you've got to stay under a certain amount. And you could tell that answer choice C, if you paid them like $100 each, then that's not okay. And that works for answer choice C. If you paid $100 an hour each. Answer choice B, it does not work when you pay them $100 per hour each. And then you could also look at other pieces, which is she must hire at least three junior directors. If you, let's say you didn't understand the uh, 640X plus 880Y is less than or equal to 9700, but you did understand she must hire at least three junior directors. Based on that, you could eliminate answer choice C and D. And let's say you understood she must hire at least one senior director. Then it's got to be greater than or equal to one, not less than or equal to one. So those would be gone for that reason as well. So if you don't understand one part of the inequality, then look to another part. Thank you for joining us today. If you like this video, click like. You could share it with someone who has trouble with these long word problem inequalities. If there's any question you'd like to answer from any official PSAT or SAT or ACT, leave that in the comments. I'd be happy to shoot a video on it. And click subscribe so you don't miss anything. Have a great day.